you guys, I can't believe I was so stupid and I did that. I thought there was something else. Like you get through your FM, you meet in the crew room, and you're like, oh, freaking, should we go or should we not go? And then, but I guess, okay, I got ahead of myself. Oh, uh, because I could. I could keep going. With, I could keep with my original plan. I could do the whole Reaper thing now and deal with the consequences of that action. But I don't want to right now. I don't I don't want to have to deal with it. There, there's one thing that I really don't like about that, and I'll tell you when we get to it. But for now, uh, for now, forget we progressed the story because we haven't. We've gone back. Um, and I, I think we're just going to do something really quick. Uh, we're gonna freaking save this crashing ship in this one. I think so. I mean, at this point, I also now I'm like, oh, freaking, I don't want to like go surging through all the planets. Like, I want to go, I want to go to the story. <laughs> but uh, MSV Broken Air, I don't even remember what this is about. It's not on my thing. What is this place? Jonas. Uh, Normandy sensors can pick out a hand painted sign. Some waggish employee left outside the complex. Last chance fuel for 100 light years. We see anything? No? Okay. Hi, oh, oh, there's that. And then there's this Saturn planet. Pretty! It's spinning quick. Okay, an extra solar catch. Excellent. Well, let's go save this ship. I don't know what this is about. Whoa, that's really bad. Gas meter detected above. What is up with it? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Can you, could you not? Could you, what is wrong with the graphics on that? Wow! Oh my gosh! Like, really? This was in the finished game? Is this part of a DLC? I don't think this is part of a DLC. Oh, wait. Oh! Ships manifest as volatile munitions cargo on board left on the stair of the ship's injecting the impact with Jonas. High probability the crash site will be far gone. Jonas is the largest human colony. Gas signatures detected above the MSV Broken Arrow. Freaking, why not? Why freak not? What are the Geth doing? I don't even remember what we got this. Uh, this we've had this for ages. I don't even remember. <laughs> well, I guess we'll bring out Thane and Samara for reals. Although we're gonna be fighting Geth, so it's probably stupid. Although, I had to say, for the Reaper, like, they didn't die very, very often, so I'm, I'm pretty impressed. And we're gonna bring the Arc Projector. For sure. And I think I'm gonna put Samara on the Vindicator. And we're good. And I don't even have, I don't have all the upgrades. The Whoa! The planet's surface is oh my gosh. Wow! This is dramatic! Wow! Whoa! This is very dramatic! What the heck? Um... Captain's log. Yellow alert. Let me shoot the yellow alert. Get... Uh... We are ill-equipped. Is trying to scuttle the ship. Tries to stay aboard to make sure the ship dies gracefully. Yeah, so he w turns out he wasn't able to get it. Looks like he wasn't able to get it the way he wanted it. Okay, okay. I feel like I actually kind of have done this before. Was there a mission like it in Mass Effect? No, I... I think I, did, I think this was actually one where I bought brought um Samara and Thane 
together, maybe. I'm having really weird flashbacks to that. If it is what I think it is. How did we even acquire this, though? Hey, guys, it's been a while. Shredder Ammers, you. Shredder Ammers, you lose you. Shield's down. Wow, that was fast. Wait. Oh. Oh, excuse me. I have my shotgun on still. Don't mind me. Oh my gosh, I'm sneezing everywhere. Stand up. You missed. Trying to get through, or is it just trying to explode? Yeah, I've been here before. Okay, I remember this. I have no idea what I'm doing. I believe this is a bad spot. I could totally be wrong. Shivert, do it. Squishy thingy. Oh, or that one. They can't rush. 
crush us, so... We're stuck on our little platforms. We've done it. Oh, did we do it? How fantastic! <coughs> oh, wow, really? Okay. 156, okay. I don't know if there was anything else on there, but... What the heck was that? I don't know. <laughs> That little that took like three minutes. Strange. I feel like there was possibly more to that than what I uh, allowed. <laughs> I don't know. That was funny though. Yeah, I was wanting to like explore all the planets and the galaxy and the systems and stuff and. Now I'm just kind of like, oh, I want to go do the thing. Um. Uh, I suppose we could go do a DLC. We could go do the Firewalker. I don't know, that one seemed kind of short. Platinum Rich Planet. There's Overlord over there and Firewalker over here. We could secure smuggled cargo. Now let's check out this. Mm, Firewalker is over there. I don't know. At the end of Mass Effect 2, can you just keep going, like, wandering around like you can in um, Mass Effect 1? I'll have to look that up be interesting. I don't, I kind of don't think you can, but I don't know. Elistia. Zionia. Whoa. Found the mangled wreck of a Prothean starship. Huh. Interesting. Alright. Paleontology, Turian, something or other. I like to get to at least the planets in the system I'm gonna do a mission because I want to see if they'll tell me anything. Okay, nothing particularly distinctive. Um, Count the Spectre already missing at points that business are selling platinum, a strategic metal, to pirate groups and thermos systems. The results of our investigation were never released, but no deaths were reported. Sulfur, sulfur devouring bacteria that thrives. Haha, <laughs> nice. Oh, these bacteria and genetics similar to the native light of ilium, suggesting either a panspermia spread of microbes via asteroids or accidental contamination of the original environment by careless spacefarers. Oh, what was that? I don't really need anything, but I think I, I, think I, need, I need more platinum actually. <laughs> If I want to do the med bay. There it is. Launching probe. Scans have found something. Located the hammerhead expo- The hammerhead! <laughs> also shows active data storage sites. <coughs> Make need uh, whereabouts. <laughs> Alright. I don't know. I don't know if this is supposed to be a really long one. I don't think so, but I don't know. I think it's just supposed to kind of introduce the hammerhead, which is, I believe, the the, the shuttle of choice in uh, Mass Effect 3. Well, that was an excellent mission we did. <laughs> the three-minute mission. Oh, uh, well. All right, looks good to me. Oh, cool. Nice. Reminds me of the planet where we pick up the R on Mass Effect 1. Whoa. I don't think I 
want to just have like a face mask on. Like I want, I want a whole helmet. And his is just like a balaclava. Like this does not look very secure. I almost started doing the searching thing. Well, shoot, this looks like it's been abandoned for ages. to explore planets in Mass Effect Andromeda. Hello, beautiful. That is not the hammerhead I know. No, we're all like, oh shoot, I didn't get a chance to look around at all. Okay, whoa! Systems online. Welcome to the M44 Hammerhead Infantry Fighting Vehicle. Ooh. This is your onboard VI. Woo! Mission objectives located. Caution, guided missile system active. Okay. Whoa. Down, down here, I don't think. Oh, look, we got this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, I know. Oh, press uh, X. Why? Oh. Well, why is this ship freaking out? Like you're not like rolling along the ground, like you're gliding. Choo. 
sick <laughs> you know the constant up and down like victory maybe he was talking about the hammerhead and we don't take the hammerhead i can't remember now that's so funny though Jeez. well that was really easy that was fun though i like that kind of reminds me of those things you see in destiny a little like uh cricket looking thing i don't know what they are but they they fly 
the gliders, little gliders. Is that it? Commander, you've received a new message. Yeah, you, I better terminal. have a new. Uh, oh, right. You've retrieved your identity from the docking data aboard the MSV. How did you retrieve my identity from that? What did I do? Like, leave, leave a, a, a D tag around? Like, leave, like, a rose around? Like, freaking Cassini used to do? I'd rather believe that your crew is responsible for saving our colony from a catastrophic event. Not only did you defeat the debate together, provide the ship from crashing into the planet, the trajectory that would have destroyed our colony, we also nearly 100 munition crates that would have been lost in the ship's scuttling. Thanks to you, we are safe and can continue the Broken Arrow's work in arming the colonies on the fringe of good space. You're welcome! Prototype. Good work on recovering the hammerhead in one piece, Commander. It'll prove you feel, prove useful. Also, the data you recovered from the MSV emergencies we can contain significant intel on a few planets that Dr. Case and Dr. Oloy investigated. ED has added them added locations to your galaxy map. We hope that one of them leads you to the Prothean site. Despite Dr. Case's obvious instability, he's proven to be a brilliant and dedicated scientist. If you salvage more of his logs or journals, it would greatly help our efforts. We still don't know how to get there tracking Dr. Case, so be careful. <sighs> what? I don't even, I, I, uh, he said, I remember there was something vaguely going on in the background about how it's not safe, he's gonna go to, like, Olay's, Oloy's camp or something, but, freaking, I don't know. Project Firewalker, wow. Inside an active volcano. Uh, run test, death incursion. Ah, okay, interesting. Oh, so maybe I'll meet when I go to these planets, I will be going around in the little hammerhead. Okay. Oh, I still haven't done that. I did that way back, but I haven't redone that again. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna call this one here and leave it kind of interesting, I guess. <laughs> Mostly I did it so that when I saved and then I reloaded probably next week. It's uh, not gonna stick me in the middle of that situation. It's gonna stick me back here, so. Um, but in the situation that occurs after the Reapers, but after the Reaper thingy. But anyway, thank you guys for joining me. I appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one.